Oh, knock it off. Well, what up, Dave? How are you, my friend? I actually have your box in here. I think this is it. Yup. Hey, Elizabeth, how's it going? So, yeah, first box up. Uh, since Dave, you're here, we'll open Dave's box. He did a, I believe it was a 25 box run. Uh, I hope it's Kurt Cobain, Dave. Um, but, uh, and then he opened a bunch of them. Uh, hey, Sean. He opened a bunch of them on uh, either booze and pops or pops and shots last week. Sent them out. Uh, but super excited that this was the pop that I ended up getting. Uh, ended up getting ourselves the FYE exclusive Kurt Cobain. Uh, he's missing the bullet hole, but that's okay. Um So, what up, quick draw? Yeah, so uh, that that's a fun pickup for me. Um, I'm glad it was in, in my box. It is never too soon, Dave. And you sent pack peanuts, dude. It's never too soon. It's never, never too soon. Kobe jokes would be too soon. <laughs> anyway. Um... Next up, since Sean is here, uh, I got a box from him. I'm pretty sure I know what this is. Uh, as most of you know, I'm a uh, Patreon on Sean's channel. And uh, we uh, we like to have some good times once a month, do a Patreon box battle. And, and this, this, uh, this month around, I won. Um, and it's always against iCards, I swear. Me and iCards going back and forth. I think I'm two and two. Uh, yeah, the battle's here. That's the thing. Thank you, Sean. But the wife isn't here. But this is definitely... Uh, she will be definitely excited to see this and add that. To her collection, Mr. Gaston, Series 9, number 240, Beauty and the Beast. She actually has the Mystery Mini here as a, or ha has it as a Mystery Mini. I think there's a Diamond of Bell in the dress, not 100% sure. So, what up, Will Be Poppin'? How are you, my, how's it going, man? Yeah, I'm not sending Sean packing peanuts. I know he loves them dearly, uh, but it's not happening. So thanks, Sean, for, for putting that on, man. The battle's here. It's, it's a great thing. Helps support his channel. He gets an awesome video to put out for everybody. Um, I love doing it. Like I said, it's usually ver me versus iCards. Um, I think the first video I did, I actually ended up beating Sean. Uh, and I got uh, Metallic All Might from Barnes and Noble, um, and then this is my second win. So uh, I'm like two two, and I think there was a tie at one point. I'm not, I don't remember. I think I'm two two and one. Um, if not, I'm just two and three. So I know, Sean. I know, man. You've never won. I, I kind of feel bad, but I love. But you are winning though, because you get a you get to have the video. You get to put out some great content. You put on a good show. You're you're like the the ringleader of all of this. Uh, you know this this crazy pop circus that that we we subscribe ourselves to. So we appreciate you. Um, next box up is from a pop couple, but it is not for me, so I won't open that. 
because I don't know what's in it, and it's really light. It's probably some mystery minis. What up, JJ? Um, this is from Spastic. Um, pretty sure I know what this is. This is uh, I picked this up for somebody else, but because uh, he was looking for it as well, and I wanted to make sure that he got it. Yep, exact. That's exactly what's in here. So we'll uh. Oh, he double boxed this bad boy. I mean, it's it was like eighty dollar pop or so. Um, it was from Curtis's spastic drop uh, last Friday. Not not this most recent one, but the Friday before last. It takes a week to get pops across the country, apparently. But I wanted to make sure Justin still wanted it. Justin from Poppin' Hand, he was looking for this, and so it is. It is scrump. Um, I'll give it a good once over, snap him some pictures of it, send it his way, and see what he has to say about it. This is a cool, cute little pop. Comes with comes in that uh, series of Lilo and Stitch. You get Stitch six two six, Elvis Stitch, and Lilo herself. My wife's a huge Lilo and Stitch fan, so if he doesn't want it obviously staying in the collection, but uh, I purchased this for him because I didn't want him to miss it, and I already had it in my cart, so Justin, I'll, uh, I'll hit you up here shortly. Uh, oh, the big boy. So I won a raffle about a week ago. Uh, pretty expensive pop. And it's not my intention of keeping said pop. So go uh, go over to Instagram, check out Coca Cola underscore and underscore waffles, and uh, get a chance to go check out this pop, as it will be going up there later today. Really nice pack job. it is captain rex fall convention 2018 so new york comic-con shared got a cool he's got a sticker in there that looks pretty sick got the winning number right there uh actually it's the same line as ahsoka as she's skyrocketing in price so yeah what about kobe sean what about kobe it's never too soon but yeah, we picked this up. Uh, I'll be putting up a bunch of pictures. Anybody interested? Got to get your spots quick because I have a feeling this is going to fill up really quick. All right. How are you guys doing today, by the way? You know, it it's sun shining nice out here. Ollie hasn't said a damn thing. No, Sean, I haven't won any of the Kobe's from him. But it's still, yes, you're right. It is still a J-Boy win. I won the Captain Rex and uh, Grievous as well. I won General Grievous. He should be here Wednesday. Um, I don't have Kobe, Callie. It's, uh, it's for Captain Rex. Um, and it'll go up on the, on the good old Coca-Cola and Waffles Instagram page. Mondays are great, JJ. I'm sorry that... You know, let's let's go through here. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Stupid fucking yeah. There. There. People get wrenches. I finally need to do this. Give out wrenches. Jesus Christ. Anyway, but yeah, no man, it is Monday. It is sun shining. Ollie hasn't said a word. So it ain't going to rain. It ain't going to rain. Right, Ollie? Hey. Right? It's not going to rain? No? Okay. I'll let you go, and go back to looking out the window. Jesus Christ. It's more like, Bob Saget! It's my other, other favorite one there. But, yeah, man. What up, LBD?
All right. Next up. I don't know what this is. But it is from... I don't know if this is technically for me or not. Uh, but we'll open it. Oh, no. No, this is a future video for the wife. She, uh, she's got some cute but deadlies in there. Those are definitely her thing. Um, I will not open that. Sean, I've, I, you need more donuts. Uh, who, who doesn't need more donuts? Um, last two boxes here. This one's from good old Chalice. It is not a mystery box. Um, I've been secretly hiding these, or at least trying to, from the wife. Because I know she loves Gravity Falls. Uh, hey, I'm putting on the winter weight already, Sean. I know you're trying to get rid of it. But we had to go back to Chalice. $30. Uh, pick up good old Dipper Pines. Gravity Falls. Elizabeth, I wish I could use DoorDash where I live. Um, I live in the middle of freaking nowhere, uh, really. So there's the set. We're missing one of whoever this is. Mabel Pines. Obviously, Grunkle Stan, and then there's a Hot Topic Pig. Um, we're missing that one as well. So there's good old Dipper. And Chalice does a great deal when they do the do their bundle deals. But here, it's the glow in the dark. Chase, Dipper Pines. I've actually never... I don't think I own a glow-in-the-dark chase. I think this is the first one. I've never pulled one because I failed at Kid Flash. I failed at Naomi. Um, the only glow-in-the-dark chases I have are sodas or uh, Paco Pacas. But yeah, Dipper Pines, glow-in-the-dark chase. Let's go. Gravity Falls, good stuff. Looks in really good condition. They must have just been hoarding these. Um... Just having them sit in the warehouse forever in a day. Yeah, Sean. So we got we got thirty for those two, and then we also did the thirty for Bill Cipher and uh, his chase as well. So can't argue that. I think somebody either sent us or we got in a mystery box. We had gotten the the rainbow exclusive Mabel Pines, and that just kind of kicked it off. Yeah. Is that the only, I mean, is that just me or is that the only good thing coming from, uh, yeah, th th those were nice bundles, but yeah, we'll be popping. Is that really the only nice thing really coming out of Chalice now? Because that's, that's, that's really what there is. Because I don't, I won't buy their boxes. Won't buy their mystery boxes anymore. After some convincing from a few of you, it's just not worth it. I mean, it probably wasn't worth it when I bought the $80 box from Toy USA, 60 guaranteed. And then it cost me 20 bucks to get it shipped from Florida all the way out here to the left coast. So I really need to hit 100 bucks in that box to make any money back. But we all know what I'm going for there. The black Elodin. I probably would cry. I probably will cry. Yeah. And then last but not least, I know he's not in here, but coming from coming from Mr. Devin Knotts's parent company, friggin' uh, whatchamacallit, Walgreens. That's the place. We got a Walgreens pickup. Whoop, whoop. Uh... This is a giant ass box for how how light this is. Uh, 
that's how they pack their pops. Just kind of toss them in there. That's how I throw my pops around, apparently. So I've been the only Marvel pops we've been collecting are the 80 years. Um, these three from <laughs> he's in fucking backwards. We'll fix that here in a minute. But uh, these three from Walgreens, they don't have the black box like the rest of them do, but they do say the Marvel 80 years on the back. The metallic green goblin chase is is that from Walgreens? I guess since we got him out of box, let you guys see Mr. Sandman. He's probably I, I, think he's a, I think he's a villain. I I'm again I'm not the biggest Marvel guy, but I just like the the fact that the 80 years they put the first appearance. Uh, comics on the back. I thought that was a great, great choice. So there we go. Sandman's all turned around. Ready to rock and roll. Um, so I went ahead and I got the set. Next up is Mr. Craven. Craven the Hunter. Just like Yoj's Craven D. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Quick Draw. I appreciate it. I, I mean, I'm assuming Craven and Sandman are both villains. Uh, just kind of based on their appearance. I mean, he kind of looks like, uh, yeah. So yeah, I had to pick up both of these. And the third one, Scarlet Spider, Kane Parker. Um, you guys obviously will have to let, let me know. You know, is this a is this a villain as well, or is this not? Because, like I again, not not the, not it uh, not a big Marvel guy, but I do like the eighty years. We have almost all of them. I think we're missing the Nick. Is it Nick Fury from New York City Comic Con? Um, the other Walgreens one that came out that I think glows in the darks. So, yeah. Okay, Jaden. Okay. Yeah, because we all know there's a massive spider verse out there. Uh, it's like there's a Deadpool verse. I mean, come on, you got Gwenpool hanging around. No, 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 Hi, Alexandra. Welcome to the party. So, any of you guys pick up anything awesome lately? Hear any rumors about anything new coming out? I haven't been on much of the what's coming except for... Okay. Well... It's not my scrum. She can get mad at Justin over at Poppin' Hand, but I will show Alexandra the scrum. Even though I know Miss Alexandra, she got her three pack with with scrum in it. But Alexandra, there it is. Yeah, no, I had, I got it for for Justin and Andrea down there, and I know he was trying to get it. I just wanted to make sure that he got it. Alexandra, I would let you dibs it if it wasn't already spoken for. V, my dude, what is up, V? How are you, man? How are you? Spider pig, 
Spider Pig does whatever Spider Pig does. Can he swing from a rep? No, he can't. He's a pig. Look at it. It's a spider pig. Alexandra, as soon as he pays me for it and says do it, sure. Um, but yeah, no, that's the pickups for today. Uh, I mean, this is the big one. Mr. Captain Rex. Uh, is, I think current PPG value is 250 for the shared sticker. So V, I'm... I'm managing, man. I'm managing. I'm just hanging out, talking about uh, AP wants Captain Rex. Well, no. No, 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 no. No, I have a have something planned with the funds for this. I'm kind of excited because we did we did one thing yesterday, as some of you know, but we are going to be doing something else. I'm going to take Captain Rex out of the box. Why not? Okay, Sean. Sean. Sean, are you paying attention? Who's this? I don't know who this is. Okay. Thank you, Sean. I appreciate that. Super Saiyan 4, Goku. 4? Alexandra, no. You you get all the vaginas. So let's take a peek at Mr. Rex. Look at some corners here. Just because he is a stupid spendy pop. <laughs> uh, I love the fact. He's fifteen dollars when he came out. Whopping fifteen bucks. Sean, you better watch it or I'll send you some fajitas, man. Not a big fan of pop stacks as most of you know. So this will actually go in a pop armor uh, and get sent out to the winner. Like I said, go check out Coca-Cola and Waffles on Instagram, and we'll uh, we'll raffle this baby off. Phones are going to help somebody uh, get something special. And, Sean, that's not my problem that you're still working on the tacos. You should probably eat faster. Alexandra, it's it's uh, times three hundred. Did anybody get one, JJ? Uh, do 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 do. Doing things, people request. I oblige. Shh. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. I would love a quesadilla. Jordan. He, he can, it's all good. Him and his love affair with tacos is perfectly acceptable. Thank you, Elizabeth. I appreciate it. I Everybody just go check out the channel or check out the IG page. Um, it's probably going to go up. I want to make sure I get all the pictures on there so you're all informed about condition and everything. 
Um, like I said, it will be in a pop armor. Um, so, V, I'm sure you and Sean would wholeheartedly agree. Tacos or Riot? Sean, he's jealous because you're a buff baby. LBD, you know, man. I Heck yeah, you do, V. You, out of everybody in here, have been subbed to the channel more, longer than anybody. You've been around for a minute. Uh, we can call them monkey wrenches. We can call it pipe wrenches, um, channel locks. Whatever you want to call them. But, but yeah, we can we can go with that. Callie, I'm all right, man. Uh, you know, things are not things are not the best, but you know, what do you expect when you uh, You know, you lose a loved one. It's 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 rough, man. And this community's been insurmountable in the support and everything that they've offered me here. You guys have offered. You guys. So uh, I think without this, I would have gone absolutely batshit crazy in depression, grief. Uh yeah, without this, I mean, I have my wife. She she's been a fucking rock star through all of this, and it sucks because she hasn't had herself time to grieve. So it's, and I'm going back to work next week, which is not gonna be. Sean, I won't know if I'm going to eat the, sh the chip until Devin sends it. But I can tell you this. If somebody pays me good money, I mean really good money, I won't just eat the chip. I will torture myself with said chip. I will grind it up in little tiny pieces and I'll <laughs> give, a little, give a little snort. And then we'll give my nose a milk enema after that. So. But there would have to be a large amount of money involved in that. But I will eat the chip for free. I will eat the, the death chip for your folks' amusement. Uh, I love spicy things. Love them. Uh. I don't care if my face sweats. I don't care if there's snot running down my nose. I love spicy food. Elizabeth, we've Devin already, I think, is sending sending it over. I think he is. Um, now, JJ. I'm a trained medical professional. <laughs> so, Pepto, gallon of ice cream, and then a gallon of milk on standby. So I ha I'll eat the ice cream and the Pepto beforehand. Eat the chip, and then chug the milk. That's the plan. I'll probably end up throwing up just because of so much dairy. That's just my thought. Alexandra, you are welcome. I hope you... Uh, actually, I need to go buy more ice cream. I ate a lot of ice cream Saturday. Lots. Ollie, come here. Ollie, come here. Come here. Come over here. 
Come here, you little turd. Come here. Fine. Fine. Ollie's too excited that the weather is so nice outside. He doesn't want to come play. Lola. There you go. Come here, Fluffy. Come here. I'm trying to get one of the dogs, and none of them want to move. They're all, like, in a comatose state. Lola, come here. Come here. Come here, turd. Come here. Come on. You're, you're wagging your tail like you're all happy. Just come here. Come here. JJ, I have a lot of experience with snorting things as well, my friend. Uh, cinnamon, pepper, salt, really weird. Uh, obviously, pixie sticks. Um, Frank's Red Hot. That's a terrible idea, by the way. Don't snort anything liquid. It permeates and lasts forever. Uh, Callie, I probably will do it on a Friday night. I'll probably, or maybe just be drunk and dumb and do it on booze and pops. Maybe I'll do that. Come entertain the masses on a Saturday night. Come here. Come here, Cyclone. Come here, Summer. Come here. Summer, come on. Come on, baby. Come. On. Why does no... What the hell? I'm grabbing a dog. Ugh. We got one of the fluff monsters. Miss Lola. She's the queen bee of the house. Aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. She tells everybody what's up. Yeah, V, that's one of many puppies, man. One of many since the last time. But as most of you saw... My buddy. Ooh, Sean, good question. How many of the fluff fluffs actually sleep in the bed? Summer, Ollie, and Lola. So three out of the five dogs sleep in the bed. Um, Lola comes and goes, so really two and a half. But Summer and Ollie, Summer sleeps at the wife's feet. Ollie sleeps at my feet. Lola will sleep in between us until she gets too hot. Heidi, our 19-year-old minpin, sleeps wherever the fuck she wants, whenever she wants. And Baxter, hey, did you poop in the fridge? Hey, did you eat the whole wheel of cheese? Come here. Come here, old man. Yes, you. Don't look around. I'm talking to you. Come here, Baxter. You're getting a bath and a brush today. Your your mane is everywhere. Yeah, V. So the box for this lovely guy here. I love that he came on a stand. Like, that's that's pretty chill. Sean's never seen Heidi. Okay. All right. I'll go find the old lady. This is the old lady. She's uh she's 19, blind and deaf. But she knows her way around the house. So that's why we just let her do her thing. You still eat, sleep, and poop, huh? You still eat, sleep, and poop.
It's a uh, half and half, Sean. Uh, men pin, I mean, because of the coloring, right? The the Doberman pincher kind of coloring, and then Chihuahua, yeah. Oh, oh, lady, yeah. You're my old lady. I'll eat. <laughs> so there's the there's a box in the middle of the floor. She was not expecting it to be there. She just <laughs> straight through the box. Baxter, come here. Yeah, V, I your cold dead heart, man. It's gonna melt when you see all the dogs, my friend. All the doggos. All the doggos all the time. So who's excited for Emerald City Comic Con in uh, 2020. Who's excited for March 2020? Or do you think they'll actually do August this year? Uh, yeah, Sean. So when do you think they'll still do the re-release of Emerald City in August? So that's where, that was something that they had mentioned. I haven't seen that they were going to cancel that yet or not. Yeah. Yeah. Callie, thank you. But no, I did see, I, I, I thought I remember hearing something about August for Emerald City Comic Con. Bye, Elizabeth. Thanks for coming and hanging out this afternoon. All right, V, you have a good one, man. Um, hope you and the lady are doing good. Uh, stay safe out there and just, uh, just transform. You know what? I'm gonna open this box from the wife. That the wife, just so we have, just so I can open something. Cause UPS hasn't got here yet, and that's for more of the content on the channel. But we have a ah, oh, Justin, Justin, Justin. Stuff and things have arrived, my friend. Tats, Justin. Look who has arrived. Bloop, 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 bloop. Uh, so, Alexandra, is it Reese's Pieces? Is it uh, peanut butter ice cream with chocolate chunks? What kind of Reese's is it? Mickey Finn, sorry, man. That, that blows. That blows, dude. Justin, it looks really good, uh, corners and all. Um, I'll send you pictures. Yeah, it's got one little knit, but just let me know if you're still wanting to pick it up or not, and uh, we'll go from there, okay? So at least we know that came in, but I was going to open this box from Pop Couple. I was supposed to go to the wife. I'm just curious what it is, because she didn't. She told me it was minis. I remember now, but that's all I remember. So, Justin, is the scrump really for you, or is it more for Andrea and Pop Baby? Uh, not much, Mickey. Uh, opened uh, some Dipper Pines. Uh, common Chase Bundle from, uh, from those guys over there at Chalice, because that's all they're really good for is their bundle deals. <laughs> Mickey, yeah. No, this, this you and uh, 
Alexander Perez, both, man. Oh. Oh, I see why. This kind of looks like a bag from a Funko soda, but I'll, I'll go with it. So, looks like she got the Madigat. So, these are all from uh, Fantastic Beasts. This is one of my favorites. This is by far one of the coolest mystery minis ever. Let's pick it. Pick it, pick it, pick it, pick it, pick it, pick it, pick it. So that's a totally dope mini. What up, Tasha? Hey, what's up, Pop Supreme? How's it going, man? Yeah, you guys should go check out Pop Supreme. He had a really good video on how to hang up uh, single pops using a pop protector. It's a really good idea. Super inexpensive. Go check it out. Um, and then Mr. Kowalski with the bucket looking shady as hell. Give me your money. Give it to me. So, yeah. You got a couple mystery minis from uh, James and Lisa over there. Over at the Fantastic Pop Couple, so... And then Justin, if you're still here, yeah, we uh, we won that in a raffle. Uh, for those of you just joining in, uh, we're just kind of opening up everything. Random fan, I kind of opened everything already. Uh, so we've, we've got our raffle win here. we got a Captain Rex shared from New York City Comic Con 2018. Um, since I'm a Marvel fan only for the 80 years, we went ahead and picked up Sandman, Craven, and Scarlet Spider, all from Walgreens. Justin, you can't dibs it, and you know it. And then we picked up Dipper Pines combo for 30 bucks from uh, from Chalice Collectibles. So now we have these two, Bill Cipher. Um, Heidi has now found her way into said box that she uh, plowed through earlier. Um, what else do we get? Senor Gaston from my uh, battle tier win um, over at Sean Ryan Toys and Games. Uh, awesome, awesome dude. Puts on a great show. Appreciate him doing that. I mean, the, the battle tier is what it is. It's, it's a it's spend your tier, but it's worth it. Puts on some great content. I feel like 90% of the money that goes into that actually goes towards the boxes and then him having to ship out to the winners. Cause I mean, it's not cheap to ship two pops in protectors, well packaged. Alexandra, you know who I'm talking about. Uh, Pop Supreme. No, it's the 10 inch child from, uh, from Funko. That is said 10 inch child. Uh so yeah, uh, my box was absolutely just shit stomped from from GameStop. It was terribly packaged. I called, spent forty five minutes on the phone. Me and my buddy here, we just hung out the whole time. Uh, right? You wanna grab a beer? It's too early, huh? Yeah. It's five o'clock in the Atlantic somewhere. That's my reasoning. So, yeah, man. No, it was... The box was absolutely just shit stomped from GameStop. So, bummer there. And then we... Last but not least... Mr. Kurt Cobain. We got in our mystery box from Mr. Dave Soften, or Big Dog Dave, as he's, uh, as he's known in the community as. And uh, probably one of the best custom 
makers. This is my opinion. Custom painters, in my opinion, just because I think he does a great job personifying pops into clowns. Uh, what's up on useful unboxing? How's it going? Pop Supreme, yes, yes. I mean, he is the mascot for booze and pops. No joke. No freaking joke. Um, I think that's really all I got today, guys. Um, you know, we kind of went over everything. You know, is there anything coming up that you guys want? Uh, Oh, we picked up a new computer, so hopefully the streams will be better. Uh, actually picked up two. Got a laptop and a desktop. So hopefully they'll be better. Yeah, so the 10-inch box. Um, random fan. The 10-inch box is literally two 10-inch pop boxes side by side it's huge all because of the ears um i don't know man this 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 computer on my end it's bad because i can't do anything else with it really uh plus we want to be able to use the laptop camera to stream or not stream, but actually film. So hopefully get a better video quality with that instead of this dinky old camcorder that we had for years. You know that that got us going right off the bat. You know we owe. I don't even know why all the videos disappeared, but it is what it is. Uh, we had a ton of videos of us opening Pokemon cards. Uh, I think we started opening during X Y <coughs> Fates Collide. It went all the way through. XY went almost all the way through Sun and Moon, and then we kind of got out of it. Eleven and three quarters by eight by four and three quarter boxes are perfect for twelve sodas. Okay, it's good to know. Um. I'm down, Callie. I'm down. You know, you know, I, I'm getting a bunch of freaking sodas. Like I, I have 21 of the Pennywise coming because of how they originally announced it. It kind of went haywire, and then I ordered the six pack from Curtis over at Spastic. I'm pretty sure I used Code Taco Man on that one. Make sure. Uh, you can use it on use their codes. So the Luau, actually just Luau, uh, Taco Man, Salty, or Blame Pop Couple. You guys can snag yourself 10% off of everything but mystery boxes over there at Spastic Collectibles. Um, I use it as often as I can. Use one of the codes randomly. Um, you know, I went and picked up two display cases. Oh, you know, it's not as long. I think babies, babies are a little longer. Random fan. So I mean, maybe a preemie. This is probably. Well, I guess you think about it. Babies are usually like twenty-two inches, and this is supposed to be only ten, right? Alexandra, if you had code meh, I would add it to my random generator. If it actually worked. I would add it. Yeah, it's only because of the years, man. I was doing this with him the other day. Woo! Yeah, this one's getting some use. Uh... Well, guys, I think that's it. I got a bunch of cardboard to pick up here. Thanks, everybody, for for coming in, showing up, showing out. Appreciate all of you. Uh, as you can see, all the dogs are behind me up on the 
even Bubba the Cat. Oh, I didn't even realize he was in the picture. But yeah, all five dogs and the cat all out to have a good time. I'm so excited today, though. Uh, we have like 30 pocket pockets or some non some crazy ass number coming in today. Uh, so super excited for that. Um, yeah. Got some other stuff. Oh, we got our own pickups from the spastic drop. But since this weight changed, the shipping changed. And so actually, uh, Scrump was sitting in my, uh, P.O. Box Saturday, but for some reason it wasn't. I don't know. Um, but today our Lilo and Stitch three packs coming in. So, uh, and Alexandra, I know you got your Lilo and Stitch three pack, and I was so happy to see that you actually got it. Uh, just knowing how much of a Lilo and Stitch fan you are, specifically, I think Stitch is your boyfriend. Pretty sure that's a thing out there. Um, yeah. So. Anyway, guys, SS4 Goku, Cope, signing off. Have a good day, guys. I can actually... Ah! It won't close. Bye.